Bracky. I'm going to tie the leaders and hopefully the sun's up. I'm going to put the boat in. Hopefully, I'm going to slay a big bar. So, I'm giving this new cast leader a try. Lewis Shop hooked us up. 60 pound, so I usually run for bar. Going to give it a go. It looks the goods, but we'll see how it goes with abrasion and holding up yeah. the big fish. The air is still freezing cold, so I've still got my jumper on. But the water temp is getting up around 25. So the other weekend when we went out, we got them few barrows, it was sitting at about 22 in the morning and come up to 24. So in the morning, it's already starting at 25. And yeah, hopefully they're gonna have a chew today. Well, we made it into the creek. All I'm doing, I'm going to about to tie a few lures on, but I'm just sort of cruising up this side here, all the way up. I'm just throwing the side scan out. Let's see if I can see any barrows out on the side. Yeah, I'm going to tie a couple lures on. I'll show you what I'm going to use, and then hopefully I'll find a few barrows on the side scan. This is what I'm pretty excited about. It's a cast paddle tail squidgy, is what I'm calling it at the moment. I don't know the full name of it, but I'm going to chuck that on the blue steel with a quantrum. And I'm going to chuck a Samaki Vibalicious on the Jabber's five-piece rod. Bit more of a jigging style rod, so flick this around, jig this, hopefully some big barrows. I was just throwing a few um, plastics around on these snags here just for a quick little look. And I think over on the other side there, I can see heaps of crocs. I'm going to go over and check it out. That is cool, man. Water must be cold, so they're all up sunning themselves on the bank. Bjorn, they didn't get let me close to have a look at them. I've picked up something on under there on the side scan. I think it's a nice, oh, it's a big grunner, man. Oh, a big grunner. That's pretty sick. Oh, he dropped him. Yep. Got to get a bastard. Seen him land up under there on the side scan. Little chromy. Got him. First bar of the day. On the cast squidgies. Yeah, that was a good jack come out first and then I flick, skip flicked it back up under there and then that barrel whacked it. I think there's only two fish in there so I'll keep cruising. Second fish, I think it's a dirty, dirty, dirty thready. Just see him sitting behind that snag there. He's gonna click this bloody boat in a bit of gear. Yeah, a little shreddy. Absolutely whopped that car squidgy down. What a cool little fish. Yep, he's got a nice salty. Squidgy. We've got about one more bar around here, this lure, and then it's buggered. But they work very good. See how we got a nice bit of colour here in the water. Bit of movement back, Eddie. We're just going to be very quiet. Have a little play around. Oh, she's done. She's done. Oh, barrel there. Here, little 
fucking bastard. Finger ma. Go. Okay guys, I think I've found the barrows. See you got oh shit. Barrow looking clubs there. And then before when I come over on the side scan, it just looks like there's a school of 40 barrows just sitting in just in here. What do you reckon? I'm pretty excited. I hope like my sound is not that great, but it picks up enough, so I'm pretty sure this is a big barrow school. We'll see how we go. That was no good. I pulled one little barracuda out of there. I don't know if they're not biting or they're not there or I mistook something. Looked like bar and maybe it was the sticks, but I'm gonna reassess with the sound and then keep cruising up the creek. Oh well guys, I got my totem out of a big barrel hole. Oh. As soon as I dropped the vibe down, boom, hooked up. And that was the only good fish I could see on the sounder. I sort of loaded him up and then just dropped it instantly. And I sort of played around here for a bit longer and then got that black broom. Oh, it's pretty slow today, but that's what happens in winter. Um, might keep playing around here for like five more minutes and then cruise back over to that snag there, have a little play around there and then have a bit of lunch. This fella here is drilling, so you're gonna have a bit of tucker too. We're gonna keep cruising up this creek, sort of getting over, trying hard and getting nothing, but I'm just gonna go find, I've been to these parts of the river before, so I'm just gonna go find something new, push up as far as I can with as much fuel as I got, and hopefully smash a few barra. Might start flicking a few hard bodies around, cause they were firing back down the mouth there before. They were sitting up in the shallows and I was just putting a side scan on them, and yeah, keep punching. Alright, I found a bit of life in this area. I got a juvenile, I think it's a black jewfish, but there's another species that only grow pretty small. I'm not sure what they're called, it could be that, but pretty cool. Let's see if I can get another one. Oh, beautiful little finger mark. Oi. Fish sitting there, I can see barras coming out. You can see the whole barra. But I think that's sort of a barra there, but oh, you can see it there, see? I think that's probably a finger mark. Barra sitting low there. But yeah, they're not chewing. They just got one barra bump and I got that finger mark out here. And yeah, just struggle street today. I'm gonna keep cruising up. Start flicking a few hard bodies, I reckon. Try to get out of the deep. Everything that's sitting deep is real dormant at the moment, I think so. See if we can get something happening up on surface, about a meter of water. Ooh, my salty bar and I'm and hooked up in the trees here. He's not even hooked. That lure's just in his mouth. That sideways. Ooh, it's a nice fish. Yeah, baby. My bib's gone. Look at that. That's pretty shit. Oh, Baronello. Oh, it's a pretty slack day, but this snag looks pretty hot. I'll let him go and I'll keep going. Oh, I've pushed way up this river and the water's turned really dirty. I had that hot session back there and the water was like blue, aqua clean. It's turned dirty and I've got nothing for like 10 snags. So 
it's about 3.30, so I'm gonna head back to the ramp, pull out and sort of make a plan what I'm gonna do tomorrow. Might go for a hunt on a neighboring station with this dog or might come out tomorrow bar fishing. Woo, she's starting to glass out. Holy, this is insane, man. Good boy, good boy, get him. <laughs> this is a proper big pig. Oh. oh boy. Woo! Oh yeah, big boar. <laughs> that was a sick little, I don't even know what that was. I'm beaming off adrenaline right now. I'm gonna drag this big boar off the road so no other animal like hawks or anything that eat it, wanna eat it, he'd get hit by another car. And then me and Blaze are gonna keep cruising. I don't know how that video is gonna look, but that was full on. Couple bad shots, but I still got him. He won't be doing any more damage to this wetland area anymore. So, yeah, I'll see you in the morning. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him. Next week. Woo.